Five Nights at Freddy's. Now, I'm sure if you've been on the internet within the past year that you've heard of this indie survival horror game. It was made by Scott Cawthorn, and it's it was pretty much made famous by, you know, Markiplier. Yeah, pretty much it was made famous by Markiplier with his first playthrough of it gaining 30 million views in like 10 months. Five Nights, it's pretty much like seven nights you actually spend in there, not five. It's probably just a surprise, people, but a, but a good surprise, though. Anyways, there there have been three f Five Nights at Freddy's games in total, and they're pretty fun games. The first two are okay to me, the third one is just... Meh. It's, it's not as exciting to me. Oh, also, the new one just came out yesterday, July 23rd. So he's just like his animatronics, just BOOM! Pops up in your face when you least expect it. Scott, you're sneaky. You're sneaky like a ninja. Or Five Nights at Freddy's animatronics. Five Nights at Freddy's animatronic ninja? Oh no! Five Nights at Freddy's, it's its one of the biggest growing fan bases ever. And it keeps getting larger and larger constantly, every day. With fanfics, every, everyone in the world doing let's plays of it. And hell, even Warner Brothers is making a movie of it. Please God, don't let it be like Dragon Ball Evolution or Avatar The Last Airbender. No! Goku never went to high school! He didn't! But the Five Nights at Freddy's games have gotten somewhat ridiculous. I mean, I do respect the game designers and everything like that, you know, making your own games, practicing, that's, that's really cool. But either way, there are a lot of fan games. There's Five Nights at Wario's, Five Nights at Treasure Island, Five Nights at Big's Box Joe's, Five Nights at Frozen, Five Nights at Pikachu, Five Nights at Naruto's, Five Nights at Obama's, Five Nights at Ojontron's, Five Nights at Markiplier's, Five Nights at Minecraft, Five Nights at SpongeBob, Five Minutes in Heaven! Oh, okay, okay, maybe that last one, uh... This isn't really a Five Nights game, but you, you, you catch my drift. Five Nights at Big Box Joe's. It's one of the many games where you play as Markiplier. That's awesome. And the first thing he does is tell Wade to shut up. Oh, shut up, Wade! Poor Wade. Also, the game's great, and now but there aren't many jump scares, and the battery lasts way longer than the night, so you can almost keep your doors up, like, almost all the time and keep them locked up all night. <sighs> good. I can get a good night's sleep. I like all the fan drawings of Markiplier. It's a unique touch, and but it's a little too easy though on this playthrough. Uh, but before the previous update, it was it was way too hard. So we need something just a little bit more in the middle. Other than that, it's it's not a bad game. One day, however, two men went missing. They were never found since that day. The factory has been closed due to people thinking the factory was closed. Well, did, did, didn't anyone else work in the factory or what? Oh, wait, this is what's gonna happen. Warrior's gonna take over all the amiibo factories and I'll never get my amiibo villager. I was gonna rename him the Killager. I only got like these three guys. Diddy Kong, Peach, Zelda. I guess I'll just name this one Killer Kong. Anyways, the factory closes down near the night guard because it's opening back up. And, oh wow, 200%. That's a lot of power for this game. And oh my gosh, it goes down fast. Oh, Wario, he looks pissed. Almost like someone has planned to nerf him in the Smash 4 update. Or it's because you never got your own princess. But hey, at least you don't have Waluigi's body and how it's oddly shaped. Uh, this game is more funny than terrifying. Five Nights at Wario's, it's, 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 it's a well-made game, but it, it, it made me <laughs> laugh more than get scared or anything. Okay, Five Nights at Disneyland. A, a troll face? Oh, it's not ready. Really? Did you just call me bra? Bruh. Okay, if you're gonna make a release, then please make a release, even if it's not finished. Yeah, I, I still could have beta tested this out. You don't do that. I don't put up with crap like that. I do not. Well, check this out. Move to recycle bin, and empty recycle bin. Aha! How do you like that? Five Nights at Frozen. Just two more to go. Oh, really? Frozen? They just couldn't let it go? Okay, this game's power and time go down well with each other. Best that I've seen out of the fan games, and oh, Anna came after me pretty fast. But before all this, I thought that what the guy said was pretty messed up. Dad's been really upset about you ruining his country's reputation and all stuff like that. Working night shift here has been a punishment that Dad came up with. Yes, because attempted murder equals punishment. Here and go! Is that, supposed to, what? Huh? Is that supposed to make me feel better or what? 
I just, I, I just feel like Jasmine is taunting me now. Last one, Five Nights at Naruto's. Let's see if I can win this one. I probably can. Believe it! First, the room is totally dark. And there are only outlines and cheap drawings of the characters. Okay, I die, but I won. I'm going to night two. Maybe I use a substitute jutsu. Hell yeah! I still get to go to night two. Suck on that, Akatsuki. Or Uchiha clan. Whichever. So many Five Nights at Freddy's fan games. I mean, seriously, there are so many. And, like, some of them don't even go to night five. Some are too hard and some are too easy. But hey, I mean, it's cool there's a fan base, but dang, it's a lot. So now I gotta ask, especially since the new one just came out, you know, and I'm gonna play it soon. I gotta ask, are you ready for Freddy? Because I am. <laughs> Oh, I'm, I'm ready. I'm totally ready. Oh, but but now, now be, be, be like something like just hiding in the corner, like not even hiding in the corner, just like a vacuum. I I pretty much jump out the window. And also, I live in a two-story house. Jumping out the window in a two-story house sucks. It's a long fall. And just like Five Nights at Freddy's Four, I I have a closet and two doors. Oh, oh, no, not the power, not the power, not the... Oh. Oh, no. Uh, oh, no. Okay, just, uh, j just stay away till 6 a.m. And, uh, and, uh, uh... <laughs> Ryoka Matoi. See, I wear like red headphones like I'm black. So I'm gonna do the Ryoka thing. Like an effing attacker. What are you? Shit, shit. Wait, something over there? Oh, tiny box didn't moved. The box is moving. I guess that's all I gotta look out for. Definitely.